One million subscribers! <laughs> Later in the video there's going to be a giveaway for some 3D printers, so stay tuned to find out how you can win. But if you haven't been watching my channel since about 2012 when I started making serious videos, here's a brief recap of how we got here. Hello, this is James from xrobots.co.uk and today I'm going to tell you about my homemade vacuum forming machine. <laughs> And here are the rigid parts that I've cast so far from the moulds I just showed you. So all of these parts are basically made of... So this is basically the lower body is mostly done and also the torso, as you can see. I don't have a bum plate on yet, so I'm not going to turn around too much. working a bit more as desired. Let's just try walking forwards now and see how that goes. Bigger steps. Yeah, seems to work pretty well. Try, try and lower down. Uh, it's not an obsidian! There you go. So today I can announce with a measurement of 3.62 metres that you are a new Guinness World Records title holder. Congratulations for the tallest 3D printed sculpture of a human. Alright, thank you very amazing. much. Congratulations. Cheers. Well, I'll rotate the sticks, gonna call around. 
and there's a whole menu on here of all the transformations. So it's like a toy transformer where you have to do one bit before the rest. Which button makes it go sentient and attack us? None of them yet. None of them. I'm gonna put it on a wheelbase eventually. <laughs> so there's something about this that's so powerful. And when I actually use this for reals, I'll have a jacket on to cover that up. Okay, it's all set up. We're going to put it in a box so we can surprise the kids. <laughs> hold Buster, hold Buster. And all the things with his metal hands. And you're an Avengers spy, so I brought a Hulk Buster. We made Hulk Buster. Kids loved it. Hello, it's James from X Robots. I'm in a very special location with a very special guest. eBay Star Wars Project Time! Yes, I'm in Colin Percy's shed. How are you doing? So now we can have to test the droid on grass and see how that goes. All right, well, it's not working too badly. The ground's a bit bumpy though, so we might need to get some sort of floor surface for some of the bigger shots. We've got to hide it because the kids are coming and it's all a big surprise. Just look over here. I've got a surprise for you. What do you think of this? It's James, have you heard of a band called 1023 Megabytes? I haven't. That's probably because they haven't made it to a gig yet. <laughs> oh my god, this is it, video's over, I'm off. <laughs> so you will not believe it, but both rockets are intact, they landed perfectly and everything went okay. And we didn't even use the spares. Yes. Well, I think we've got glue.
Well, I think it was Colin Furs who coined the phrase the hacky X-Men, and this is definitely one of them. So let's see if it works now I've got everything on. Ah! Yep, seems to work pretty well. Ah! 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 There are, of course, too many projects to feature, but the first clip in that sequence is from 2011, so that's 10 years ago, and there's still a few projects in the channel from before that if you'd like to go and check them out. Now, I rely quite heavily on 3D printing these days to get my weekly videos made, so now it's time for a quick ad from the video sponsor, which is Lolspot 3D Printers. And Lolspot have been supporting my channel since about 2014 with 3D printing hardware. So Lolzbot have said they're going to give away two 3D printers to celebrate a million subscribers. And that's going to be a Lolzbot Mini 2 and a Lolzbot Taz Workhorse. And all you need to do to win is the following. You must be on Twitter. You must follow me on Twitter, that's at xrobotsuk. And you must follow Lolzbot on Twitter, that's at Lolzbot3D. You then need to write a tweet tagging Lolzbot at Lolzbot3D with hashtag James Bruton in it and then a short reason why you'd like to win a 3D printer. And if you haven't got enough characters, because only get 140 characters in a tweet, you can do another follow-up comment to your tweet, but please don't write an essay, because someone has to read them all. Then between us, we're going to decide who the two winners are, and Lolzbot will be announcing that on their own Twitter and shipping the printers. The closing date is seven days from the publishing date of this video, so make sure you don't forget to do it in time. And that's it, and then they're going to give away two printers and ship them directly. So, if you enjoyed this medley of clips from the last 10 years, well, there's plenty more projects coming up, hopefully in the next 10 years, so don't forget to like and subscribe. Alright, that's all for now.